Hello guys, thanks for checking out the channels. I'm gonna go through a quick CSS font trick to use here in group page to get your custom fonts in a really really some super simple way. There is a lot of different methods out there, but this is uh, the one that I found is the easiest by far. So the first things obviously would be to download the font. So. If you didn't check my previous video about how you can customize an element in group page, how you can uh, customize the, the shape of the picture or the, the, the uh, image in, in group page, so uh, please you can go and check it out. Let's continue with our font customization. It's obviously you can go to the uh, Google fonts to download the free free fonts there from there. I will work uh, with an example a Lobster uh, font. You can find a lot of free ones here or you can go and you can pay for them. I'm gonna use Lobster today. In my example i'm gonna use it for now basically you would just download that bring it in your computer you're gonna to need to convert ttf file to web phone so i will show you how we do this first so after we download the family here download family of the phones i need to convert this uh, file let me go to the lobster we have ttf file I need to convert this file to web font file. How we do this? I will put the link where you can convert this uh, file TTF to the web uh, font through this uh, website. Just upload your file and uh, you can just uh, convert it. I already converted the file so we have it here Lobster font. Uh, after I open it, I have it with the CSS format what we have to do now i'm going to copy the entire code from here yes control a control c and then i will go to the group page let me open a new uh, page so we you're not going to be confused in this case okay i will try i will take uh, yoga challenge landing page so what we are going to do now we need to to paste the code that we are already copied from the CSS file uh, we can copy it to the uh, beige setting or to the site settings we can go here edit settings but I prefer to just do it in the site settings here in the custom CSS I will paste the code and now i will copy again again this uh, font family lobster Control c and the bottom i will do a small code it's really easy simple way just uh, follow it and you will get it now we put hashtag and uh, let's name the name with the same uh, font name and now, this is what we already uh, copied from uh, above, and I will close it. So here we have Lobster. You can copy this one, this word, the name of our font, and save. Now it's important to click on the site settings save. Now we are going to wait until we get content save so we have it now we can use our font it's really really easy now let's select this uh, text join the 21 day online detox challenge i have selected the element we have here h1 tag we have here text we go to the custom attributes and then we will have elements id attribute here we just enter the name of our font or the, the one we insert in the hashtag as you see my friends here's how we can customize our fonts let's try it with other elements go to the custom attribute and then elements id attributes we have our custom font as you see here elements id we have it 
any font you want to switch to change to the lobster just insert it in the id attribute all right so if you have any questions leave them in the comments and i will be happy to answer them but once again this is a super simple and powerful way to get your custom fonts into group page all right thanks a lot